What's up guys, it's Lance from LJB Fit coming to you guys from the spare bedroom in my house. Gonna do a review today on the Quest Bar Protein Bar Chocolate Chip Cookie Dough. Chocolate Chip Cookie Dough, just as promised. Just like I said in the last video, it was coming soon and here it is for you guys. So, let's get straight into it. I'm gonna show you guys the macros. Gonna try to show you on the camera here and if you can't see that I'm gonna put them up somewhere over here really quick before we start <laughs> alright I wanted to go over a few of the comments from the last video uh, the last review that I did um, so first I wanted to say thanks everybody for commenting and watching my video thank you Quest Nutrition for actually watching and commenting on my video um, uh, Marissa L. Riley and I think it was McKinley Griggs, yeah. You guys recommended that I try the pumpkin ones. Um, I'm really not a fan of pumpkin at all. Pumpkin? Pumpkin? Sky, Sky always says I say it weird, but whatever. And uh, yeah, then a few other people. Um, Danny Flores, he said that the s'mores is the best one. If I find the s'mores one, I'm definitely going to pick that one up and try it out too. Um, but do, do, who else? Just Seth recommended that I put it in the microwave, which I probably should have did. I didn't even think about that. So uh, next time, if it, if this one's terrible, then I'm gonna have to try that out. Oh, Van Watt Gym Channel wants to uh, steal my Quest bars from my mailbox. He's a he's a thieving postman. Oh, and Kevin Kevin Clements recommended that I try the. Ooh, do, do, what name brand did he say that was? Promax. He recommended Promax protein bars. He said that those were great. Um, I did look them up on or on Amazon, and I was like, eh, maybe, maybe in the future I'll give those a shot. So thanks for your recommendation, Kevin. Anyways, let's get into this. Let's get into it. Bam. Boom. Let's see. Look at that. Can you guys see that? Is it going to focus in? It looks a little shiny because of the reflection from the sun. I got this window open right here behind the camera. But uh, it looks good. It smells good. Mmm. Tastes good. Just Seth, I'm not going to have to microwave this one, buddy. I'm not going to have to microwave this one because it tastes good the way it is. Wow. Last bite, guys. This is much better than the last one. Really good. As far as protein bars go, I'd have to give that, let's go with seven and a half Lance faces out of ten. And I say, I actually lied to you guys, the last bite is right here. I'm going to go give this to my girlfriend because she got to try the last one. I'm going to let her try this one too. Where were we? Really good. Really good. This one's much better than the last one, Quest, if you guys are watching. Alright. That's the end of that chapter. What's going on, guys? I want to show you guys some deadlifts from the other night. Um, this was 345, which was 90% of my one rep max, I believe. And I hit this for... Two, 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 four sets of two reps um, for those that don't know i had a back injury a while ago and i probably mentioned it before but anyone who's new to the channel might not know that's what the road to recovery series was all about and yeah so on with these deadlifts um the previous video i i i had a clip on there and my hips were shooting up immediately after i started the deadlift so this week, I tried to bring the hips up a little bit higher instead of squatting down as far. I was having a conversation with Ben King. Um, so this one's this little area here is for you, bro. I want to 
to show you what I was talking about. But yeah, I'm trying to keep the hips a little bit higher instead of dropping them down as low. Because normally what I would do is I would get down into almost like a like a parallel squat position to start my deadlifts. So uh, I'm trying to correct that, keep the hips from shooting up as much, which you still see they do come up. But I think that's just because uh, because of my femur length or something like that, you know, because I'm taller. But yeah, thanks for watching, guys. Uh, thanks for watching.